But first at five tonight, a man serving a minimum security sentence at the ACI could end up spending a lot more time in prison. That's after police say he took off from a work detail earlier this week. Yuri's Pena's arrest was breaking news yesterday, live at five. Today, the accused escapee faced the judge. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly was in court for the arraignment. He joins us live from the ACI in Cranston tonight with our top local story. Yes, tonight an inmate who was already in trouble here at the state prison in Cranston is now in even deeper trouble. Matter of curious Pena. It might have been a temptation 25-year-old Curry's Pena simply couldn't resist. But it likely will cost him. He went before a judge in Warwick today on a charge of prison escape. The state police say he walked away from a minimum security work detail on the grounds of the state prison in Cranston on Monday afternoon. He was serving four and a half years for breaking and entering into a home in East Greenwich. His freedom didn't last long. The police arrested Curry's Pena yesterday afternoon, only two days later. He was walking on Dayball Street near Updike Street in Providence. The police like to remind inmates who might be considering making an escape, you can run, but you can't hide. Uh, investigation revealed that he walked over to the Shaw supermarket in Garden City and subsequently uh, obtained a cab uh, and went somewhere into the Sackett Street area of Providence. Curie's Pena may be wondering whether his limited liberty was worth it. He now faces the possibility of an additional 20 years in prison. That's because escapes from work details, which partially rely on the honor system, are treated much more harshly than ordinary escapes. Officials here at the state prison are now reviewing the circumstances surrounding this escape. We go there, new at 6. Live at the state prison in Cranston with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.